Mr. Grafton? Did she fight? Not exactly. But she's gonna put some millionaire in touch with us. We came here to get dough out of her. Don't worry. We will. In case the joint fix the alarm to stop operating just when we want. And I know exactly where the safe is. Yeah, she'll pay up. Whether she likes it or not, she just doesn't have any choice. Oh, yes, milady. I'd know that chauffeur's face anywhere. Name's Malloy. It used to drive for an American mob who came over trying to queer our pitch. How fascinating, Parker. What an adventurous life you've led. <laughs> Great, milady. Uh, but what about this grafting geezer? Uh, he must be a bit shady, as you might say too, milady. You could be right, Parker. This project sounds a bit too good to be true. Anyway, I'll contact Jeff Tracy. He'll know what to do. What's up? Well, nothing's up, Jeff, but I'm onto something that needs investigation. Well, it's something that anticipates a disaster and saves us a rescue operation in the future. We're all ears, Penny. Well, I've had a Mr. Warren Grafton visiting me. He's trying to raise money to complete his monotrain scheme. Hey, that must be Grafton of Pacific Atlantic. Yeah. They've been having trouble with the U.S. government about safety precautions. Penny, you say he needs money? Yes, Jeff. So I said I thought a friend of mine would be interested. Meaning me, I suppose. <laughs> All right, Penny. I'm always on the lookout for interesting engineering investments anyway. Where can I get in touch with him? He'll be returning to his New York office tomorrow. <laughs> 